Let me say clearly that this is one of the projects we are passionate about. You agree with me that since the creation of this state in 1967, we don't have what you call a pleasure park. Sorry. And I do know that nowhere in this country can you say you have a pleasure park apart from the one I hear they have in Abuja where you have trees. That is not what we describe as pleasure park. But here we have a pleasure park as described by the special advisor a special project. It's a special project because it is an idea developed and conceptualized from my office. Having traveled around, I've always asked myself, why is it that we can't have a place where people can come and wind themselves with their families, relax, and have different kind of activities? So that when you go home, you are well balanced. And so we find that we must provide something like this. And to attach importance to it, it is not on any of any contract uh, firm that will come to develop it. We believe we should give it to a company that when they develop it, and when they develop it, you'll be happy that yes, you will. This park will be commissioned December this year. It's our passion to bring back Port Harcourt, what it's supposed to, to be or what it used to be. And that is why we are taking all these measures to see that we put the right things in place so that people also will come as tourists to come and handle this place. Now, in terms of the management, we agree with Jairus Berger that they will, you know, for the maintenance of the place, they will handle it and train our own uh, People. Yes. Look at civic center today. The plant is managed by government. It's gone. That is an edifice built by the former military administrator of that, uh, that uh, spiff. And we are bringing it back. We are rebuilding it. And after rebuilding it, we will not allow government to handle it again. It will be by private individual. The Perhaka Pleasure Park is another of the new vision of the governor of Priva State. This commitment to renew the health and indeed the spirit of rivers people, visitors and residents alike, is being flagged up here today to the provision of world-class recreational facilities meant for children, adults and the elderly alike. I must say here that these world-class facilities for the children will include a playground, it will include a climbing tower, and of course, uh, it will include a balanced bar for the adults. I must make uh, it very clear here that uh, a lot is being provided to boost our health. Today is the 26th of May 2016. To the glory of God, the part of the construction of this Portacot pleasure park for the use of our people and to the glory of God, in the name of God the Father, Amen. the Son, Amen. and the Holy Spirit. Amen.